There we go. God, every time I, I, I have somebody pop in on the mic and then I can't figure out how to turn on my microphone. How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the Game Channel. My name is AJ Gels. How y'all doing? We are back with... What what game is this now? This is uh, State of Decay 2. There we go. All right, so we head to the potential clinic site, talk to Shoebox from the practitioners, get his medical advice. Uh, we could do that. Uh, I also kind of want to take start taking a look at that play cart. But... Yeah, we'll 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 do that. That group apparently wants some food. How much food do we have? We have 17 food. Oof. Jeez, do I want to load up a rucksack? Jeez, it costs four food to do that. Take a look at our base. Plus two food a day. Minus one. Oof. Jeez, uh. Oh, yeah. If we put that in, then we'll increase the yield of... So we can make that back in one day. Okay, yeah. I got the food symbol as a pizza. Okay, so I'll run that over to those guys. We need to fix up that truck before we start using it again. Taking the taking the Kaiser. <laughs> Guys, still love how we found this thing. Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> it's stuck in the windshield. I'm uh, gonna try and take out one of the plague hearts in this game, or in, uh, in this video. Yeah, every time they're at this. Is this a little home base? Hello there. Goodbye. Oh wait, real quick. I forgot Peña has a increase to fighting discipline. Like uh, all she can take is endurance. Okay. Uh, but also because she has such a high shooting skill, I decided to give her a better rifle. Bam. Hey there. Goodbye. Okay, who wants this freaking sack of food? out there questioning our goals and that's okay whether you support us or not red talent supports you i'm not a talker I'm about getting things done because kind words aren't going to bring order back to this world sure red talent gets things done but they just rub me the wrong way thank you Bye. get off Alright, now let's head back. Let's head down and meet those guys. Oh, shit. Alright, guys. Question of the video. Who... Alright, not, not who. Not what I wanted to ask. What is your biggest uh, E3 hope, prediction, uh, thing you're most excited for, any of that stuff, go to the comments, tell me. I'm interested. Um, I mean, just a little bit before I recorded, I, I, got, I saw that uh, Days Gone finally got a release date, February 22nd. Um, I'm, my head's starting to hurt with all the announced release dates just because there's so freaking many of them. I mean, it's just release date after release date after release date that just keeps getting announced. It's uh, it's a little hard to keep track of, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm stoked for uh, stoked for Days Gone. I've loved the concept. I like the uh, I like everything. I like the survival aspects. I like the the character of Deacon. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm pretty pumped up. I've been I've been stoked for that game for a long while now. 
So it uh, looks like we still have about a good place for an outpost. Looks like we still have about another uh, half a year till the game comes out. Ooh, refueling site. I guess that's all there is to see. Military trauma tent. Ooh. That trauma tent might be a good place to go when our uh, medicine runs out. So, uh, but yeah, Days Gone probably would have been the thing that I was most excited to see at E3. Um, and I still want to see some see some gameplay for it. Um, all that. Um, also, quick heads up, uh, nobody's keeping an eye on it. Sony's apparently having a a uh, an un uh, they're announcing an un they're announcing an unannounced project tomorrow. So keep an eye out for that because I think uh, we since we had the release date for Days Gone. They announced Tetris yesterday <laughs> for VR. There's also a uh, Hitman too. Also got a uh, got announced, which uh, I think that's coming out later this year. Which I like the first one gameplay wise, story wise. Nah, eh. I, I I could take it or leave it. Jeez, I'm sorry. I keep I keep uh, I, I keep getting off off topic here. Uh, what am I looking forward to E3? Uh, I mean, I, it would have been Days Gone, which I'm still hoping we see. I get to see some gameplay. But all in all, I'm not. Uh, I, I just can't, that game can kind of sit in my back of my mind now that I have it. What the hell? Now that I have an official release date for the game. So, uh, really, uh, show it to me. Don't show it to me. I won't necessarily be really sad. Um, I think the thing that I'm most <sighs> see, there's so many things I'm I'm actually really excited for. Come E3 this year. Jeez, where the hell am I going? Um, so many, there's so many things this year that I'm that I'm excited for. I mean, the Sony conference alone. I mean, Last of Us Two. I'm still hoping that we get uh, get a release date. And uh, you know what? Now seeing that, um, seeing that Days Gone is going to be the front half of next year. I, part of me sitting here thinking. Are they are they gonna do Days Gone? A sur you know, Sony gonna do a survival horror game in the front half of the year, and then do Last of Us Part Two later in the year? I I don't know, but looking forward to a release date for that. I know we're gonna see Death Stranding uh, from Kojima during that conference, and um, that just has me curious because it's Kojima. <laughs> I mean, Ghost of Tsushima. I, I'm really hoping we get a release date for that. Uh, I mean, there's 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 plenty of stuff. Just the Sony conference alone, I'm interested in. Uh, AC Odyssey. Shit, what else is there? <laughs> there's tons of other stuff too. I'm still hoping for Gears of War four, or uh, excuse me, Gears of War five. Uh, the announcement on the on a new Splinter Cell, hopefully. I mean, again, they're uh, that would be a sweet ride if it still works. So many there's there's plenty of other things that could plenty of other things I guess that uh, could be announced. What I I think we're going to see oh um, um bah, 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 the new CD Projekt Red game uh, Cyberpunk 2077. I think we have a really good shot of seeing it at uh, the Xbox conference. Uh, Square Enix is doing one this year. Bethesda, so we're gonna see Fallout 76. Um, Oh, hello. I love the Kaiser, but... Oh, it's got no gas. Uh, pray and ye shall receive. I saw a turntable not too far from here. Too many deadheads or I would have grabbed it. Meet me if you're interested. Work for me? God, finally, we can do that mission for fanning. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh, Bethesda's conference, I think, has uh, some, probably is going to have some cool titles. Uh, EA's, I'm probably the one I'm least excited for. And that one, uh, at least that one get, kicks off the conference. And I mean, there's some stuff I'm interested in. I mean, I'm, I'm going to guess we'll probably see some of Anthem, some uh, Battlefield Five. So, eh. 
but she's there. I mean, there's tons of stuff I'm excited for. It's hard for me to pick what I'm... I think what I'm most curious about is Death Stranding, just because I want some solid details on that, although it's Kojima, so, you know, good luck with that. Um... <laughs> As far as, as far as pure excitement, though, jeez, I know nobody's nobody asked me this question. I'm asked. I'm 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 just I'm kind of answering my own question. I, I I don't think I have a, like a good answer. Yeah, I, I don't know. I can't. I I, th I think the thing that I'm most excited about for E3 would have to be... Would have to be The Last of Us Part 2. Just because of how much I love The Last of Us. I'm And I so want more solid details on that game. So I'm, I, that's the one I'm most excited for. But I think the thing I'm most interested in is Death Stranding. But again, just because I want to know some... I, I just, I just want to know things about the game. Cool, Andy and Fanning are back up. I'm like, why can't I switch control of characters? And I'm like, oh yeah, I'm out, uh, out scavenging. Oh crap, those are survivors. <laughs> I think I see a plague heart. Crap. All right, that's awesome. Problem is the things that got a little too much kick. The cool thing about getting hit with new problems is that you get to figure out new solutions. Go, go, go! I want it, I want to make that my, make that a home site. I don't know why I want it though. Go loot that gas station. I want, uh, I want some more. I'm uh, hoping I for us to talk about more than just survival. We're gonna rebuild this world. We have to tackle big projects. Uh-huh. Ah. Because Andy's a warlord, so now we're spending some time here. Gonna have to start thinking about building an armory. Again, when we move to a bigger home site. Oh, 
when we move to a to a new home site. Oh, that's cool. Gasoline. Max level and discipline. So basically, I, I think honestly I think Pena is our best character right now. I want to take I want to take out that plague heart but I just don't have the explosives like that's my thing I need explosives to go take those things out Ankle, sprained wrist. Okay. What's this do? Ah, uh, I, I, I'm gonna. I, I feel like I should save that for when somebody's more hurt. I just wish you wouldn't have been hurt from my stupidity. Come on, there's got to be one more resource around here. Think about ah, uh, there we go. Oh, there's some good stuff here. All right, we'll dump this off in the truck. Grab the other fuel. Or we'll then uh, head back and dump off Pena, and uh, we'll take out uh, Fanning. She's got that uh, that mission that involves that turntable. I love how there's a gas resource here inside this building. We've got plenty to spare. Head back home. You know, I was thinking about taking that baseball field as like a next home base, but now I'm kind of thinking maybe we should actually start moving uh, up this direction. Oh, well, I mean, there's no, uh, I mean, we're doing just fine where we are. Oh, crap, that was a, an outpost, not our home base. We're doing, we're doing just fine where we are. We just need to, uh, I don't know. I just like to move somewhere that I can build more facilities in. Said. Just 
Yeah, keep saying this though. I'm not taking on Plagueheart without a bunch of explosives. Frankly, that is a resource we're a little light on. So I probably need to refuel this truck. need to look into fixing up that fixing up that truck head over here dump off the gas just dropped off a bunch of goodies jeez it puts us to 26 hmm you know what then actually I'm thinking about yikes too loud yeah cuz I think 25 is our capacity Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'll actually break open the uh, the gas, the the resource we have in the back of the truck. Oh crap! Ah, there we go. Maltov and a gas pump, or a Maltov and a gas can. All right. Okay, so we have a frag grenade, a flashbang, thermite, uh, three thermites, and four. Eh, I guess we actually have more explosives than I thought we had. But I'm just, I'm just not ready to. Good luck with this. Oh wait. <laughs> ah, didn't, don't jump. Godspeed. What's Pena, or what's, uh, I can't, why can't I remember the doctor's name? Okay, she's got that PPK, fire 22s. Fanning, there we go, jeez. We got three for that. Take a bandage. I'm down to my last magazine here. Jeez, I need a new a new weapon. Hey. Keep pressing the wrong buttons today. And my weapons are really starting to get damaged. Oh, cool. We got a got a cardio level. Backpack. Oh, <laughs> all right. Yeah. All right. Oh. I mentioned how much I love running things over in this game. I might want to do some scavenging while I'm out. An ambulance?
There we go. I was like, no, I don't want to lose this truck. Are you, dude? Yeah, because a uh, dirty greenhouse is the first place I'd think to look for a turntable. I mean, it's common knowledge. The one thing every good greenhouse needs is a turntable. I that that might be wrong. I I don't. Uh, I, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't garden. So. I just spotted a bloater. Yeah. Good eyes, dude. I wonder what makes plagues. On I gotta remember that thing can move a lot faster than. Me. Oh, goody! It's so freaking close to a. The feral. Get in the car. Get in the car. <laughs> car oh okay when it said a greenhouse I was thinking uh not a not a not a house that is green we can. <laughs> this may this just ma started to make a whole hell of a lot more sense why hello there don't worry I'll get you home safe nice we so needed this now that's got me grinning Yeah, another reason why we kind of need to... Oh, wait, although we could also... We could expand our... Our command center. And let us get more... Shit. We got deadheads incoming. Trying to think what to call them. More outposts. And if we have more outposts, that means we can add a... Add just like a random house as a home site. Well, that was a lot of noise. That's a, uh... Come on, there's one more. Nothing else to find here. Learn to fucking shoot. Look, you're standing in my way, dude. We left our supplies just lying around. Some of them got ruined. Please tell me that doesn't mean we lost another group of... Okay, we lost fuel. Okay, I can tolerate that. It's not good, but... 
I'm like, please tell me we didn't lose more materials, because we kind of need those. Back to the truck. There's some construction sites out here, so we can probably come here to get some materials if we need it. I didn't notice that. So I kind of wish there was like a damage meter for the car so you could actually tell, uh, you know, tell, uh, tell how bad they are at a time because, you know, it's the... Oh, what's the joke? There should be a... I don't know. There, there, sh there should be some place between uh, it's fine and it's on fire. There should be some uh, hey, everybody. places I in the middle. I found a record player, and I didn't die. Oh. Dang good news. Hey, thanks for letting me join. Our food stockpile's low. Well, then start yeah, growing food. understands music makes us human. If we give up on art, we deserve to go extinct. Why are we not growing food? Be back in a bit. God, we have six building materials. But seriously though, why aren't we, uh, why aren't we growing food? We should grow food. Just loaded my last magazine. Update, uh, well, it's all our building materials. The infestations out there is making me nervous. We need to build and all we have are old boxes and string. Infestations improve morale. Well, I'm gonna start letting, start trying to train up some of the other characters we have. He's resourceful, uh, shooting, music. How's Dominic looking? Eh, he's okay. Janice, uh, yeah, Janice could use some. She sh she could use some work. I think she's, what she's using a PPK. It's I think it's damaged. Too loud. She's in a damaged PPK. What else do we have, though? I mean, yeah, we got a couple high-powered. Oh, we got a PPK that's actually in better shape. Last mag count. Ammo dropped. Things uh, kind of keep going uh, bad to worse right now, huh? Nah, well, we're we're fine. I just, you know, rather uh, be in a better position, material-wise. Like we have plenty of plenty of resources. It's just we don't have a lot of the stuff that I really need. Oh, and space is another thing that would uh, be really great if we had more space. Guy knew this was going to start happening. I'm going to need to get a repair kit. Yeah. 
I hope nothing heard that. Empty. Well, that ain't half bad. And exactly what I was looking for. Fear for our drinking water disabled. What? Oh, base water, water for one hour. Okay. I think that's real life time, not in game time. Let's see here. No materials. Yeah, don't worry. We'll get that. Materials low, food low, no workshop, not enough beds, food low, infestation, awful scent. Jeez. Eh, All right, well, we can do something about the materials right now. Okay, I'm not exactly in trouble, but if anyone out there wanted to lend a hand, I wouldn't say no. I'm almost out of fight. See if there's anything in this... Anything in this garage that we could use. Oh, that's not bad. That's a shitload of parts. Good to go. Oh, there's a survivor in need just up the way. God, the this gun's messed up now. Freaking wonderful. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, she's not gonna take out a. I'm not sending her out with a. I'd rather send her out with no pistol than ruin one of my pistols and have to put a lot of money into fixing it. Stockpile is low, but it's better than what it was. <laughs> we'll take this thing out. It's beat up, but it's better than uh, probably in better shape than the other truck. I'm trying. I'm trying to plug the leaks as fast as I can. Once we get this new, once we get this new, um, once well, it words. Once we get the new command post, we should be able to. Oh, you're kidding me! Once we get the new command, once we get the new command center, then we should be able to get another outpost, and we can make it. What's it saying? Uh, I can't. I cannot think right now. Oh, I, then I can make a house an outpost, and then I can add a couple beds, so that'll also help the help the community 
if we can just get some food growing, like, because we have a farm, I don't know if I need to have both power and water running to it or whatever, but it doesn't say anything like that, it just... That's not very clear in the game, you know? Yeah, plus two food per day. We got a hitchhiker. There we go. You said you'd take care of it. Any updates? Yeah, we will, but we're gonna drop this person off first. So yeah, I, I'm, just, I'm sitting here thinking, I don't think I'm in as bad of a place as I thought I was, or as it looks like I am, but I'm definitely not in a uh, good place, if that makes sense. Operation Tannenbaum. We're gonna get through this. All right. Yep, that thing's trashed. Wonderful. I'm so glad. The clinic is coming together, but we need a generator to get things going. Let us know if you can help. Well, I mean, uh, we could do that, or we could just, you know, head back to our, um, our home site, because guess what? I think I have a generator or two there that we aren't using. Did not realize I had to come in here and fight. Anybody out there want to give me a hand here? So what does this mean? You made it through. That says a lot. Thank you. I just... I just keep bringing people in. We've got a place. I just, I just keep bringing people in. I shouldn't be doing this. Oh, thank God, there's a truck here. I think this is actually one of our old trucks. I'll make my way over. Hey, thanks. Let's go see what she needs.
Mikasa Sukasa. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Oh, is this our supply locker too? Yeah, this is the supply locker we have back home. Oh, interesting. Wonder, uh, Wonder hasn't checked in lately. Can you look for her in the small brown house? Sure. Good luck this one. Of course, though, she's way out the hell in the middle of nowhere. Glad I just noticed that there was a bloater over there. Really lucky I didn't hit that damn thing. Ollie, Ollie, oxen free. You're here for me. I mean, of course you are. I can't do it. Yeah, we could sure use this. That's what we need. Oh, crap. So we gotta get. Oh, so we gotta take the survivor back. Uh, back to the. Now, but that won't last. Come on, brain. Back to our our camp before we can. Uh, give me a second. I can smell that Zed horde from here. If you're interested in trading, come on by and we can talk. This place is really starting to come together. Well, actually, I was gonna, I was gonna cut back and then come drive back around, but we uh, have no option here, so it's either. This place could be handy as an outpost. Up, oh, looks like we're. Uh, For you. Looks like we lost Lexi. Oh well. I didn't necessarily need another survivor, and that was uh, probably actually a good idea. Gonna... Oh. Yeah, right, she's gonna run off. All right. Great, this truck's almost out of gas now. That's frickin' wonderful. God. It's another uh, beat up van, but it's probably got more gas than this thing. Nothing we can handle, though. And we're back. Pretty much safe and sound. I owe you one. You're welcome.
and head over there and maybe find a gas can. A bandage, that, that's an interesting place to find a bandage, but whatever. Two things that I was really hoping I'd find. What's our gas look like at, back at camp? Oh, okay, 24. And eh, then you know what? Actually, we'll just. Frankly, we'll just break that open. I mean, we got plenty of gas back home. with the trucks. I was end up riding in them. I want to, yeah, refuel. There we go. Okay, that should be enough to take us home. Cardio skill goes up pretty quick. Might as well have run the dinner bell. And more. Again, just gonna keep breaking those open. to search around here. Come on, where is it? Mother of God! Let's get the hell out. Oh, great, another melee weapon damaged. This has been a, uh, well, probably not a very productive video, but, uh, I like, I still like playing this game, just chatting with you guys, just running my mouth, having fun, just, uh, playing this game. Uh, we're gonna, next video, we'll try and get that, this morale problem under control, maybe take out a few plague hearts, now that I've, I think I got, I have a lot more Molotovs now, so maybe it'll be a little easier, so we'll, uh, so looking to doing that next time, but uh, until then, as always, find me over on Facebook, or to the website, minds.com. 
Links to all that stuff is down in the description below. Please remember to like, comment if you're not already. Please subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for more next time. And uh, please come back over the weekend as uh, all of my E3 coverage will be going on. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. And until next time, my name is AJ Gels. This is the Unthrag Gaming Channel. I'm out.